Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to a new vlog. Today I will be doing a couple of things that I wanted to show you. One of them being my nails. I need to get a manicure. I am going to do a gel manicure because last week I had regular nail polish. I was giving my hands a little break. So this week is gel nails. For the long weekend for July 4th. I have a couple of items that I want to show you from Octoly that I received to review and some items that I have purchased myself. Um, what else? I've been wanting to declutter my makeup section, my vanity, and I just want to like minimize and get rid of things that I haven't been using for months now or even years. I've been wanting to do that for a while now but I just haven't had the time and today I don't know I just feel motivated to do so so I will be taking you along I also have my gallon of water here I am almost done I actually drink a lot of water throughout the day um, but I feel like lately I've been slacking so me and my husband we went to the supermarket yesterday and we bought a couple of gallons to see if that works so today is day one so far so good the day is almost over if you guys are excited for this vlog then let's get right into it <music> they came out I love doing my nails I feel like it's therapy for me I've always done my nails this is the shade that I'm using Ferrari red it is from Amazon I will link it down below for you guys I've been using this for a while now and I honestly think that this brand is so good it lasts really long and it does not chip I actually <laughs> forgot i forgot to apply this first the nail dehydrator so my nails might not last as long let's pray it does i don't know how i forgot to put this maybe because i'm recording sometimes i don't think when i'm recording but now that i have my nails done i don't know there's something about a red manicure that makes me so happy it is so classy so nice and this red is perfect for the summer it is like the bright red i don't like the dark red so this is like my actual favorite now i'm gonna show you a couple of items that i have received and that i have purchased so this is gonna be a mini haul i also just received a shein package i always wash my clothes before i do any fashion haul so they're like hanging everywhere in my room it's so messy but i wash them and i air dry them because i find that some of the items shrink and I don't want that especially my oversized t-shirts for the gym but let me show you what I have received so far from Octoly I got the living proof humidity shield this is a spray that I think you're supposed to spray it on your hair after you dry it instantly protects usage to prevent frizz apply on dry already styled hair yep so i can't wait to try this i might blow dry my hair tomorrow for the long weekend so if i vlog it i will let you know what i think about it 
I also received these two items, not from Octoly. Skin Fix actually reached out to me, which I was pretty excited about, so that I can review these two items. This is the Resurface Glycolic Renewing Scrub. I haven't tried it yet. I will start using it tomorrow. And then they also sent their AHA BHA Renewing Cream. This is supposed to be used together. So I'm going to start using it tomorrow and give my full review on TikTok. So make sure to follow me there. Then another thing that I received from Octoly, this right here, it is the brand Goosey, Gussy. I don't know how you say it, but it is a at-home keratin treatment. I've been seeing this all over my Instagram. I was so excited to see that Octoly had it available because you guys know that I love trying hair products, especially anything that will make my hair less frizzy and shiny and smooth. This is the Smooth Operator Keratin Treatment. It looks like it is a spray. I haven't read the instructions. And then this is the Squeaky Clean Priming Shampoo. So... I guess it is a shampoo and a spray, and then I will use my own conditioner. Another item that I received from Octoly are these condoms from the brand Hex. Uh, me and my husband have been using condoms for a while now. I stopped using birth control because of all of the side effects, so this is my form of birth control right now. You guys need to practice safe sex always. And, you know, take care of your body and listen to your body. So I am pretty excited to try these. Um, I've never received any, like, condoms or, like, sex stuff for me to try. So this is pretty exciting and, like, something different. The packaging is so fancy. I love it. I cannot wait to try this. My husband's pretty excited for that. And the next item is this right here. It is a laser hair removal kit. This is from Amazon. It is AMZ Girl. I guess Amazing Girl or Amazon Girl. I don't know. It had a lot of really good reviews. I just wanted to try it out because I am so tired of shaving. I'm going to try it under my arms and my bikini area. I will be trying that that out right now um i already shaved and everything it brings everything that you need and then i also purchased the cooling gel because i heard it is better to use it with this and lastly i got this vanish pfb i've been seeing this all over tiktok this is supposed to help with the bumps around your bikini area and any discoloration or dark spots and i just want to try anything to make that area look better for the summer with a bathing suit this is supposed to brighten the skin it helps with the ingrown hairs um it helps with razor bumps you can just easily roll it around your bikini area it had a bunch of good reviews. It's a little bit pricey, but I will let you know if it's worth the money. I bought some sandals at Nordstrom Rack from Steve Madden. These are honestly a dupe for the Hermes, Herms, Hermes sandals. Look how beautiful these are. I absolutely love these. Let me put them on so you can see. Like, look how cute these are. Perfect for the summer it will match with everything i actually got a six and a half because the six was a little bit too tight and i honestly think that these are tight as well but the seven were a little bit loose so i guess i'll just stick to the six and a half and they'll stretch out when i wear them and then look at this little guy visiting me hi my baby he's gonna get a haircut tomorrow and he's gonna look so cute I'm going to try out the laser hair removal. Let's see if this is a total fail or a success. I just need to read the instructions. I'm going to be doing my armpits. 
in my bikini area. Obviously, I'm not going to show you the bikini area, but we will try the armpits together. I'm going to remove my deodorant with a wet paper towel because it says that you should not have any product on. I'm kind of nervous, you guys. I'm nervous to burn my skin because I've heard a lot of crazy stories about at home laser hair removal. I have a pretty high pain tolerance, so this might just not hurt at all. So I was reading that the first to the fourth week, you got to use it three times per week. And so to gradually bring up the levels just to make sure that it doesn't hurt. So I'm going to start with level one and then slowly bringing it up each time. Why isn't it turning on? Uh, what is that? As you could see right here, this is what it looks like. And then this is level one. And then when you click it, it goes to level two, three, four, five. The five is the highest level. So I'm going to try level one. Wish me luck. This is scaring me, guys. I'm going to wear my cool glasses. And... <laughs> Just get to work, I guess. You gotta click this button right here. So it says to just, you know. <laughs> I'm so scared. To put it here. Oh my God, I am so afraid. How about if I just do it on my leg first, just to see if it works. No, 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 I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm no bitch. Let me do this. Okay. This is level one, guys. It says to press it, and here goes nothing. <laughs> okay, it didn't hurt. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna do it again. Okay, cool. All right, this is not bad. Okay. And then let me do this part right here. Cool. I think we did it. I'm gonna do this arm. This was pretty quick. Let me let me turn this. I'm not gonna turn it off. I'm recording TikTok and YouTube at the same time, so I'm going to do this arm for TikTok, but I'm gonna leave the camera on for you guys. This was session one i will be checking in in my vlogs if you're interested make sure to follow me on tiktok because i will do updates more often there rather than here on youtube level one did not hurt that much i'm going to bring up the level every time i use it so this week i'm gonna do it between one and two next week i'm gonna do two to three and then the other week four to five just to see um, I'm not going to link this right now until I see a difference just, you know, because I don't want to recommend something that doesn't work. I will be the guinea pig for you guys. But now I'm going to do my bikini area and um, then we're going to clean up this makeup vanity. I'm very excited and I am very hopeful that this is going to work for me and I don't have to pay hundreds of dollars to get laser hair removal. Quick little update. I just did my bikini area with level two and it actually did not hurt that much. I feel like it might hurt a little bit more on my under my armpit area because the skin is a little more sensitive so i'm just doing the bikini area not the brazilian i'm not doing all of that because i'm afraid i'm gonna you know hurt myself i'm not a professional so i'm just doing the main parts this was pretty quick i didn't think it was gonna be this easy fingers crossed that this is gonna work out for me but day one for week one was a success so let's continue with this vlog this is what we're working with 
don't mind the wall we have not painted my room yet i'm supposed to paint my whole entire room white and paint the door as well we have been slacking that's gonna be for another day but this is my vanity it is twenty thousand years old this is the only vanity that i've ever had ever since i moved in with will so it's 10 years old basically um but i am ashamed at how messy this is i've been wanting to do this for a while now like look at this mess it's so dirty too i basically don't use half of these things so i'm gonna get rid of some makeup and um, probably give some out for, to my mom and my friends and then we have this corner right here which is a total mess this is my makeup bag where i have like my main stuff everything that i use here is just like a dumping ground this is where i have like my beauty sponges my brushes that i actually washed not too long ago and then this corner i have to do something about this corner i have to remove this because it's not supposed to go there i just need to get my life together and then here i'm gonna go through all of these All of these drawers and get rid of a bunch of stuff that I honestly don't use at all I need to get my life together you see like this doesn't even close ow my finger um the bottom one is not makeup it's just messiness so let's get started I'm gonna start off with this right here just finished this drawer and I placed all of my everyday makeup and the makeup that I am mostly using I have my lipsticks here my current brushes that I'm using for the next week these are all of my tools for my eyebrows my eyelashes to like tweeze them and stuff lip glosses lip oils tints my brow and lash mascara brow gel all of that then i have my lip liners here and eyeliners right here uh setting powder blush another brow gel then i have my powders here these are my ride or die and then here is where my foundation concealers my bronzer like my everything 
this is the current foundation that i'm using for this summer i absolutely love this and then i have all of my beauty blenders look at this you guys i've been swatching all of my eyeliners and all of that my lipsticks i need to get rid of this and i've been drinking my juice that i made with my juicer let me know if you're interested i really like this one this one has carrots ginger orange and i forgot the other stuff but it's really really good now i have to continue with this mess and i gotta tackle this right here this honestly took me like an hour and a half so so guilty eating this but I forgot to eat dinner because I've been so busy decluttering so I'm eating half a burger and a couple of fries balance but this burger is so good I am almost done with my gallon of water. Only a little bit. I'm gonna chug this as soon as I'm done with my food. I'm done finally. I got rid of so much makeup. consolidated I need to get a new cabinet here I have my brushes my laser hair removal some of my mascara down here I have my lashes and like new brushes that I used to get from BoxyCharm down there I didn't fix it that's just a whole mess and then my main cabinet with all of my makeup all of the necessities <sighs> I feel so accomplished I have this little bucket here to throw all of the dirty um, 
brushes and sponges and then here is where I have my lipsticks this is all of the trash right here I threw out a lot of makeup I got rid of almost all of my foundations that are super old and then this is the box that I'm going to be giving away to my mom and some of my friends I am going to close out this video I am super tired it's already 1 30 a.m i am so hot i'm gonna go take a shower and go to sleep i feel so accomplished after decluttering all of my makeup it was necessary it's been years since i've done that actually it's been one year i decluttered before moving into this house so it was necessary i don't i didn't use half of those things so um i'm just starting to let go of things that I don't use for a while. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I will see you guys on the next one. Bye guys.